All right, we're here for round two of the bug range. And yeah, we're going to keep this hand. Depending on what we're doing, we might like brainstorm into this him, like an EOT to set up our second land. We could be playing against a combo deck here, where we definitely want to hit them on turn two. Well, now I'm going to ponder. I'm going to go get an Underground Sea. Yeah, we can keep this. We'll draw the Force. And then play Strix next turn. We don't get to him, and we're a color off of this Tarmogoyf, but such is life. All right, so we're playing against not combo, which is okay. All right, so we're probably playing against Miracles or Stone Blade. We should have a good brainstorm next turn. Right, we're playing against accumulate knowledge, accumulated knowledge of this. Really? Okay. That's aggressive. So I'm going to brainstorm and hope to find another land to him my opponent. So we're seeing a new card. Okay, nice. We're going to be stuck with these Tarmogoyfs for a little bit, but like... We're gonna eventually they're gonna be good. Oh, two Nahiris. We hit two planeswalkers. Probably gonna snap ponder on my turn because we want to hit a land drop. And we know we're drawing Tarmogoyf and our next card on top is Tarmogoyf. Caster Potter. Fetch land would be nice. Wow. We're just up a million cards. I think this is a shuffle. We just want lands at this point. Right, we hit a land drop. So next turn, I think I'm going to play Leovold. Depends. But I'm forcing a Jace. Well, now I'm going to play um, my Jace because we hit a second one. We're just going to start brainstorming. We can put back... We we'll probably put back Tarmogoy. We'll put back both the pushes. And we'll just shuffle this. My opponent's deck appears to be some sort of odd stone blade deck. Alright, let's brainstorm. Alright. Put this back, put this back. Play Goyf. And then we'll somehow try to crash Leovold. Okay, that's fine. I don't think, I don't really agree with the way that my opponents played this game. Then we're going to shuffle. We don't need this Tarmogoyf. This is definitely just a plow. I'm going to force this. And I think I'm just going to keep my Jace around. Keep my second Jace. 
Well, now I'm going to draw the board. I think, I think the way that I get in trouble here is if I lose, I'm going to just start fetching some basics, is if I lose my Jace. And then I'm just going to play Glaive, too. Like, leads, I, I could get board swept, but I don't think my opponent is playing a... Uh, I don't think my opponent's playing like a, a, a whatever it is, Miracles. Because, I mean, this Nahiri isn't in there, but. So this probably gets rid of Jace. No, Jace on you. I have another Jace. Fate seal them, accumulated knowledge, but it's no bottom, yes. And I'm not even going to ponder. All right. Okay, so cards I'm excited about. Pulse Marasa, <clears throat> Sylvan Library, Liliana, Red Blast, Fluster Storm. These are maybes, Blue Blast and Fluster Storm. Probably not the Blue Blast. We didn't see any. Well, they have Blue Blast. It kills Nahiri, and they'll probably bring in Blasts for me. So, might be interested in that. And then these are maybe because of Accumulated Knowledge. Cards I'm not in love with. Don't need Fatal Push. Um, I don't like all of my forces, and I don't think we need all these tunnel lifts. So, <clears throat> decay might be good in case they have like back to basics or trophy, back to basics or monastery mentor. So I they're in a Hiri deck. I don't know. They might have something weird. <clears throat> these Baleful Strixes are not that good, actually. Now that I think about it. Like, we can just cut these and then bring in the Spell Bombs. Because it'll mess with Snapcaster Mage. <clears throat> and it will also mess with Accumulated Knowledge. Yeah, I just don't think my creatures are that good. I think I'm just trying to... We're just going to try to grind them. I don't think this is a Pernicious Deed matchup, either. Yeah, let's just submit this. All right, I say it's pretty solid. We have our basic forest, which kind of sucks. Makes the Hinder Torox not really live for us, but, <clears throat> you know, Leovold's a great card in this matchup. While I don't think my opponent played the first game that well, I think our deck had, had a lot of really good tools to match up against it. This probably has to go get me, like, UC. All right, that's nice. I guess I probably should play my fetch land. Yeah, that was stupid. All right, they get a Tundra. They're going to keep my knowledge, sure. Missing land drops. Okay, so now we're not going to do anything because our opponent's not doing anything. Alternatively, we can just run our Leovold out. We can go fetch a Swamp. Play Underground Sea, play Leovold, but then we play it kind of right into a counter spell, which I'm not really that excited about. So I'm just going to play this. And then. Yeah, I'm just always a little bit afraid of. I'm just going to get two cards out of this. I'm going to brainstorm now. We could hit a Fluster Storm. Did not. Um. Jace on top. So my opponent's got counter magic because they didn't main phase that to try to hit a land drop. Okay. 
Jeez. Oh, we got Chumbles back in there too right now. Jeez. Just kind of an anti synergy. I'm going to fetch away this chase. Now I'm going to play Leovold. So let's get another Underground C. We, we don't have to be that conservative because we have the Decay. All right, so let's go Bayou. Blue, black, green. So they're representing like Plow. And if they Plow Leovold, that's okay. We at least get two cards off of it. All right, they Force Pitch AK, right? Yeah, I would have accumulated knowledge if I was my opponent. Because if you, you brainstorm to look for three cards, but you could have just drawn three cards, but accumulated knowledge. So I don't really know what was going on there. Go land, go, and then end of turn, snap, brainstorm. Targeting me. Flash in the Snapcaster Rage. I want to hide Jace and Erupt K. Let this evolve. This opponent will probably let me keep. I could be in trouble with something like a blue, like a. My opponent plays Nahiri. So maybe I should have hid my blue blast. Yeah, I probably should have hid blue blast. Yep. I'm gonna draw this decay. I'm going to attack with Snapcaster Mage, play Nihil Spellbomb, play Land and Pass. I think I'm going to Flusterstorm this Brainstorm. I should have done this pre-combat. I think we're in a decent spot still. I'm going to decay this. I think wait till after combat in case my opponent plays a back to basics. Uncounterable. And I'm just going to cash this spell bomb in. So I'd like to hit a him. It's a really good draw. Let's thought seize. I'm just gonna fluster storm this. Not how it's gonna work. Yeah, my opponent looks like they're a little new to the old legacy scene.
but from the ashes. Can I, can I beat this? Yeah, I'm just going to take this from the ashes. My phone's hand's pretty good. Maybe I just take the Pyroblast. But then they can just snap Pyroblast my Jace. Jeez. This hand's really good. Now I feel dumb for letting my spell bomb go. I can take Pyroblast and then just play Jace and get a brainstorm out of it. That's probably what I'm going to do. Should have. All right, that's pretty good. I'm going to put... I guess it doesn't matter which ones I put back. And then we won't... That Liliana will help chew through what my opponents got going on here. Yep, we got it. So my phone's got from the ashes fluster storm. I will trade. <clears throat> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. One snapcaster thought sees. Four spells. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Okay, yeah, so we're good. So let's brainstorm. Okay. Might end up shuffling away this Pulse of Marasa. <clears throat> Alternatively, I can just Pulse Marasa back. I really want to. Uh, I guess I can fluster storm this from the ashes. So yeah, I'm just gonna put back this. Put this on top. One, two, three. Snap, fluster storm. Yeah, no, I'm actually just gonna eat it to my opponent, so that I can keep a card in my hand. And not shuffle. I guess if my opponent draws a land, I get a little boned for this. This might be a little loose. <clears throat> so now I'm going to play the Snapcaster Mage. Thought sees my opponent. Pulse Marasa. One, two, three. And then I can play Leovold, but I can't play Leovold, so I might not even I might not plus my Liliana this turn. Yeah, so let's get rid of this from the ashes. And then I'll pass. End of turn. Pulse back the Liliana, or pulse back the Leovold. I don't know my last card. 
I think my last card's actually a land. <clears throat> so I'm gonna fetch in my upkeep. I'll go get a go get a uh, swamp just to be able to all our do all our basics out. Three. <clears throat> all right, again, I'm just gonna play Leovold, not use the Liliana. Liliana's been a little awkward. I mean, it's it's just good that it's here, like it's insurance, but it has been a little awkward this game. Okay, so this is just gonna get the fluster stone out of their hand. They can't do really do anything with this Jace besides pay teal themselves. <coughs> I really hope they don't brainstorm. Really hope they don't brainstorm. Yep. My opponent appears to be just a little new. But I guess they get to keep their Liliana. They get to keep their... They get to sweep the board at least. I guess it's not that bad. And then I will just play this new Liliana. Yep. So now I got a Liliana on four, but not much else. We have a lot of lands, so we have a lot of live draws. It's pretty solid. Shut off my opponent's cantrips. Ooh, God casting this card is obnoxious. I'm just going to attack, not plus my Liliana. Keeping the forces, covering my opponent's draw stats is better than advancing mine. Now I'll plus and ditch this ponder. Actually, I can probably just ponder. Please. One, two, still have that up, so. I mean, like, this Liliana's been awkward, but it's probably just because I'm drawing so many good cards. Like, you know, like, every one of my draws has just been awesome, so I haven't had time to get rid of it. Just apply more pressure. See what my opponent's got. All right, got that one. My opponent was a little new, but I did feel like I had the tools to grind my opponent anyway. So, all right, we'll be back for the next round. 